Hello, I'm Ross. And I'm Hannah. And today we're going to be talking to some DCU students about what they think about consent. Your DCU student union's Kiss Week. Colin McDonald, how are you? Hello. What's up? Welcome to the show. Welcome Thank to you. KissCon. Thanks for how having me. How are you feeling? Me. Feeling brilliant. So, we're going to ask you some hot cues about uh, consent and that kind of thing. Cool, cool. So, we're going to kick right off into it. What is consent, Colin? Consent. Um, that would be a mutual agreement between two people to engage in sexual activities. That can be revoked at any time. Ding ding, good answer. And right. um, well to me, consent is making sure that everything is 100% go. Like if anyone approaches you, even kind of touching, kissing, anything, just to make sure we full consent to do anything, basically. To me, consent is just when both people are both in the know of what is about to happen and both have given like that they're comfortable with what's going to happen and that they both know like how far each other, each other are comfortable with. In the broad term it's when you wholeheartedly agree to something. Yes. Okay, but when it comes to sex it's almost like you have to be certain this is what you want. Okay, so you're agreeing to give this person a part of you. Beautiful terminology. Consent is when the two participating people are both in mutual agreement of the act that's about to happen. Beautiful. Absolutely. Yeah. I love the way everyone their hands. It's just easier to like yeah. together. Yeah. I'm versed in how one uses this. So this it's one latex dam. Dam. Oh, we got oh, oh, we're, we're in. We're we have takeoff. Okay. This is the first for everyone here. Okay. It looks like chewing gum. It does look a little bit like chewing gum, actually. And here it is. And according to the instructions, you place this, place this over the vaginal area, and you know, go to work. It's funny though. We actually only heard about them today. Like, yeah. Nobody knows what they are. No one knows what they are. That's crazy. Yeah, we've had a few people said they've heard them, but no one's actually seen them before. Uh -huh. Oh, oh, good start. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, it's like. Oh. Ooh. What was that? A sound, was sound effect? <laughs> now what? So, yep, that is the... That's it? Yeah, so... Oh, thanks. There we go. Thank you. It's fully open there. Oh. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> hey. There you go. It does smell like... Blueberry for everyone in the office. <laughs> <laughs> you get it done. You get it done. <laughs> also have a few... Tools. <laughs> We're describing <laughs> those tools today. Yeah. There's, there's a what few options. So, so, Kira, can you tell us what is one of these love boys? This is a condom. Very good, it is. You just <laughs> roll it down. We don't hold it. Yeah. You just roll it down like this. Um, <laughs> this is an extra large, so it'll go the whole way of the banana. <laughs> it's gorgeous. And. There you go, no more babies for you. <laughs> Boom. Wow. Like wow. a pro. Thoughts. Not right on. Now, there you go. No messing. Don't no. eat that. No messing from this man. Yeah. So far, everyone that's wow. done the demonstration has been very good. All two. <laughs> pro. Yeah, it's sticky now. It is very yeah, sticky. Yeah. Sticky banana wheel. It is lube and gel. Okay. Oh. And why would one use lube and gel? Answer. Yeah. So, yeah. Can you label at least three parts of these? Either way. I didn't know that the urethra and the vagina were two different holes until the sixth year. Really? Yeah. Okay. That is the penis. Yes. This is the. Oh, what? That's a scrotum, is it? That's a scrotum. Oh, testicle. <laughs> testicle. <laughs> Why could I not think of testicle? <laughs> Um, yeah, I do. I feel probably too comfortable. Yeah, I I think it varies in person to person, but me, like, I find I'm quite open about it. I think it needs to be talked about just because how else? Yes, we know. Yeah. How else do we know? Yeah, we need to talk about sex. 